hello friends welcome to my channel and in this video i am going to discuss about the support which i have discussed yesterday about dow jones and how it has respected all the support levels and if you are looking at the trend it has gone through all the levels and at the end of the day it has respected 33300 and at the end of the day covered up all the losses now what we have here or uh, the most important thing to understand that on 26th of january 2022 we have the fed meet and because of that the volatility will definitely persist as far as the stock market is concerned so these four levels which i have mentioned yesterday started with 34000 and can go up to or as low as 33300 will stay will definitely stay because the volatility may creep in again and only if dow jones sustains above a 34000 we will have a move on the upside sooner rather than later so what we need to do is to uh, first of all we need to make sure that dow jones is not moving beyond 34000 if it does then all the levels will again come into play and if all the support levels hold more specifically 34000 then we will have our first target which is 34660 so this is the range that we are looking at and as a stop loss you have to maintain a stretched stop loss i would say because the range this this 700 point range from 33300 till 34000 is going to be your zone of volatility so we can't do anything about it it depend upon how the market is moving and what kind of market we are into so we have this 700 point range but uh, chances are the or the way uh, dow jones has moved yesterday if it uh, remains or it will remain the chances are probably it will remain or sustain in between the support levels and we will see or uh, once things get settled we will move towards 34500 or 34660 which we are considering which we are considering as our primary target and it may extend up to here we are it may again extend up to 35000 on the upside so volatility will be there but you need not to uh, be a worry person i would say and just stay calm because uh, this is not as certain as we have seen things in 2008 or 2020 market has factored in all those things so we just need to remain calm and things will fall on the place and yes below 33300 anyways it's going to be our stop loss so below 33300 we need not to talk about that because this is going to be stop loss and we have to uh, reanalyze or reanalyze the trend again so this is the end of the video thanks for watching